Hey, it's Monday night. Once again, it's Monday night. And here we are again at VoiceOver Body Shop. And uh, yes, George and I are standing. We're not in the studio. We're outside the studio. We're actually in my backyard. You, you never would never tell. know it, would you? It, it's always a perfect sunset back here. And uh, <laughs> Thanks so. for everybody who was able to show up tonight in person. It's so special to have you guys. This is our first inaugural live concert series. Yeah. First I'm calling it a many. series because now Dan and Marcy know we're going to do more of these. Yes. This is the, officially the Dan and Marcy Leonard Foundation for Better Webcasting Auditorium. <laughs> That's a long name. Do you have it an is. acronym for that? I, it's, it's the, the arena. arena. That's it. Yeah, there we go. All right. <laughs> it's an arena hey, show right. at last. Yes, thousands of people watching tonight. Anyway, uh, we've got a live concert tonight and uh, with Soli Canto, and uh, they'll be playing in just a little bit. And uh, we'll talk a little bit about how we get this, all this done because we know you're watching all over the place. So stay tuned. We'll be right back and get the show on the road. Two men, twin sons from different mothers, with a passion for voiceover recording technology and the desire to make recording easy for voice actors everywhere. Together, in one place. George Whittem, the home studio engineer to the stars, a Virginia Tech grad with an unmatched knowledge of all the latest gear and technology in voiceover today. Dan Leonard, the home studio master, a voice actor with over 30 years experience in broadcasting and recording, and a no-holds-barred, myth-busting attitude for teaching you how easy it is. Together, to bring you all the latest technology, today's voiceover superstars, and leading the discussion on how to make the most of your voiceover business. This is VoiceOver Body Shop. Voice Over Body Shop is brought to you by VoiceOverEssentials.com, home of Harlan Hogan Signature Products. Source Elements, remote connections made even easier. VO2GoGo.com, everything you need to be a successful voiceover artist. J. Michael Collins Demos, award-winning demo production. VoiceActorWebsites.com, where your voiceover website won't be a pain in the butt. And VoiceOver Extra, your daily resource for VO success. And now, live from their super secret multimedia studio in Sherman Oaks, California, here are George Whittem and Dan Leonard. What? All right. Well, hi there. I'm Dan Leonard. And I'm George Whittem. And this is VoiceOver Body Shop or VO. B.S. Yeah, All right. right on cue. It's Big like you guys watch tonight. the show or something. Yeah, I know. We've got quite a spread of people here. It's interesting to, you know, it's interesting, you know, to try and put on an event in Los Angeles because people find excuses not to come. Well, there's a lot competing for people's attention in Los Angeles. That's true. One of them is the election tomorrow, I think. I think everybody is so obsessed with the news coverage of that, of what hasn't happened yet. But we don't, don't have any political ads on this. I know. You know this is the only place you're going to find not find them. So. Exactly. This is refreshing. Yes. So tell your friends. Right. Turn off the friggin' news and watch what we're doing here. This is way more fun. This is going to be a great show tonight. We've got uh, Rosie and Brian and Alisa Amador from Soli Canto are playing tonight. He flew in from Boston yesterday. Yeah. Just for us. Yeah. Just to be in my backyard. <laughs> Actually, they're doing a West, Co a West Coast tour. Yeah. Santa Cruz, and then they're playing in Encino, which is like around the corner from here. But you know, anyway, uh, so what does it take to put on something like this? Uh, you know, we it, we started planning this about a month ago, and I said, "Hey, we're going to do a live concert in the backyard." And you and I stood back here, like, oh, "How are we going to do this?" We were like, "What about the grapefruit tree?" Yeah, what, the, people are, <laughs> they won't be able to see around the grapefruit tree. <laughs> yeah, we thought of all different places we could put the stage and how we were going to orient it. Right. And then it was, how are we going to bring what's happening here to what's going on all the way into our studio, which is about 50 feet away. Right. And that was the next challenge. And we took care of that. But thanks. Yeah, we, we're, we're keeping it simple tonight. We're going to have one other camera at some point we might rove around with, but one camera on sticks, and it seems to be working nicely. Yeah. 
And then we brought the sound mixer that we use in studio that has all sorts of fun processing. This is the controller. This, this is how he controls the sound. For the mixer right here. I'm mixing the sound for what you guys hear on the air, what everybody here out here hears, and what this monitor speaker in front of me plays back for the band. So three different mixes at the same time. And then we have um, our lighting, which was set up by Sue, yeah. which came out really nice. Dan put a huge effort into putting up a huge green screen. So the whole no, back no, of the it's stage. Actually, we're actually on the beach in Santa Monica. Oh, I'm sorry. Wait a minute. I, I, theater of the mind. Sorry yes. about that. <laughs> Yes. Um, Can't you hear the ocean? And the, yeah. That's just and then it was just gathering all of our cables, mic stands, and putting together a system here. And I think it's working. It is. Don't try this at home. <laughs> oh, I am at home. I am trying. Yeah, we are trying this at home. We're doing it so you don't have to. Yeah. But we're going to have some great music tonight and, uh, and, and a bit of a party. And people are starting to wander in here, yep. which is really cool. Yep. And it's a happening. So come on down unless you're in Des Moines. Yeah, or unless you're on the 405 going the wrong direction, then yeah, I'm sorry. Or the 101 or at the intersection of the 405 and the 101. Uh, but anyway, uh, we've got lots of great stuff coming up over the next couple of weeks. Uh, next weekend is WovoCon. Oh, yeah. Uh, which is going to be a lot of fun. And uh, Joe Davis will be with us next week. Oh, okay, cool. He's driving, in person? He's going to drive back He's you? driving back to, from Vegas with me. And awesome. He's going to be on here. One of the best webmasters out there. And, of course, one of the sponsors of our show. Yeah. So I guess it's only fair that he'd get on every now and again. And uh, we, we have an interview with Jonathan Tilly coming up and Roy Samuelson, who's a big-time voice actor here in a couple of weeks. And uh, we got lots of cool stuff coming up. And we want to make sure that you guys are tuning in every Monday night or at least you can watch the show on replay on YouTube or on Facebook. Yeah. And, uh, but we also have some other surprises tonight. We do. It's not just solely Kanto, because we got to give them a break at some point. Right. So we, well, we, we have a way to fix that, to fill the time. You know, People can go out and drink, but they're not going to want to. They're going to want to stay here for that. Anyway, so why don't we get the show on the road? We'll be right back with Soli Kanto right after these messages. You are watching VOBS.TV. I don't know why. It's crazy what they do here. I think I'm going to go somewhere else and have a cheese sandwich. Hey, all right. We got a concert coming up here, but first, let me ask you something. How do you think about your voiceover career? Are you frustrated with your lack of success, wishing you had more auditions and bookings and making more money? Well, we all have thoughts like, I'm not good enough to be doing this professionally. I'm just faking it. I need to join the union as soon as I can. I'm too old and can't get booked. I can't get started until everything is perfect. How, many, how often do we hear that one, George? Uh, I hate auditioning because I never book anything. <laughs> Sound familiar? Well, if only you could change your mindset and get rid of these ridiculous rules. Well, VO to Go-Go's David H. Lawrence the 17th has just what you need. He's completed a 21-day journey with nearly 100 voiceover and on-camera talent just like you, called Believe 2018. And he recorded every single session meaning you can take this journey now at the pace you want and change things for the better. Get the success you deserve by destroying your limiting beliefs and replacing them with powerful, productive, enabling beliefs. And do so on your own schedule. Here's the link. Go to, to get the 25 hours of video and audio, the daily chat logs and more, and begin your own journey. The link is vo2gogo.com forward slash believe. That's vo2gogo.com forward slash believe. It's ridiculously cheap, and it's ridiculously effective. Once again, vo2gogo.com forward slash believe. As a voice talent, you have to have a website. But what a hassle getting someone to do it for you. And when they finally do, they break or don't look right on mobile devices. They're not built for marketing and SEO. They're expensive. You have limited or no control. And it takes forever to get one built and go live. So what's the best way to get you online in no time? Go to voiceactorwebsites.com. Like our name implies, voiceactorwebsites.com just does websites for voice actors. We believe in creating fast, mobile-friendly, responsive, highly functional designs that are easy to read and easy to use. 
You have full control. No need to hire someone every time you want to make a change. And our upfront pricing means you know exactly what your costs are ahead of time. You can get your voiceover website going for as little as $700. So if you want your voice actor website without the hassle of complexity and dealing with too many options, go to voiceactorwebsites.com, where your VO website shouldn't be a pain in the you-know-what. And without any further ado... Here's a live concert with Sully Canto. Thank you, muchas gracias. Thank you especially to our live audience and thank you to all of you out there in the world. <laughs> Bienvenidos, we're so happy to be here. Thank you to each and every one of you for coming. There are thousands of people here, you guys. <laughs> uh, and we'd like to uh, thank Dan for inviting us to his beach Beachfront bungalow. Por favor. Right. I mean, you know, we came from Boston. Okay, it's cold, but this is amazing. <laughs> Palmeras, there's palm trees here and everything. I know you guys, you have to use your better, whatever, right there on the screen. <laughs> what amazes me is it's sunset and it never gets any darker. How do they do that? Increíble, Los Angeles, what happened? <laughs> <laughs> okay, we're going to start off with a song uh, by uh, some, a Cuban duo called Duo Karma. And this, this song is called Ayúdame a Mirar by Sochil Galan Molinet. It tells of someone seeing the sea for the first time. Little piece of sea that consoles me, little piece of sea kissing this, the shore. I never imagined this intensity of blues that blinds me. Help me to see. Pedacito de mar que me consuela Pedacito de mar besando arena Toda tu inmensidad Dejando huella, ayúdame a mirar, ayúdame a mirar. De tierra adentro soy, de las maderas, no pude imaginarme que existiera intensidad de azules que me ciegan, ayúdame a mirar, ayúdame a mirar. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Pedacito de mar, que de mar, que me consuela, pedacito 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 de mar, que me que me que me Ayúdame a mirar, ayúdame a mirar. Ayúdame a mirar, ayúdame a mirar, ayúdame a mirar, ayúdame a mirar. Muchas yeah. gracias, thank you so much. So, here in our live uh, audience, we have some individuals who are behind a thing of light. And I would love it for, for you to move over so you can see us. I would, yeah, I insist on it. And I say, you move, por favor, so that you can all enjoy the show because we have plenty of space here. Okay. So, vamos a seguir. We're going to do actually another song from Cuba, given the palm trees. <laughs> this one is by, um, the music is by Pablo Milanes. Many of us from Puerto Rico, that's where I'm from are very familiar, and we have some boricuas aquí presentes. Uh, we have some other fellow Puerto Ricans here um, know the music of Pablo Milanes. Maybe some of you do too, I don't know. Maybe my friend Naomi, who lived with me for many years, <laughs> and is here this evening. Uh, and 
And the lyrics, the poetry, is by Nicolás Guillén, a famous Cuban poet. It's called Canción, and it says in such a quiet way, your smile gets under my skin, as if it were the springtime and I was dying. How subtle the way in which you poured on my shirt all of April's flowers. How spiritual that you should offer me a rose from your favorite rose garden. De qué callada manera se me adentra usted sonriendo como si fuera la primavera y yo muriendo. Y de qué modo sutil me derramó en la camisa todas las flores de abril. ¿Quién le dijo que yo era risa siempre, en un cañento como si fuera la primavera? No soy tanto. Y en cambio que espiritual que usted me brinde una rosa de su rosal principal. De qué callada manera se me adentra usted sonriendo como si fuera la primavera. Yo muriendo, yo muriendo. De qué callada manera se me adentra usted sonriendo como si fuera la primavera. Yo muriendo, yo muriendo. De qué callada manera se me adentra usted sonriendo como si fuera la primavera y yo muriendo y de qué modo sutil me derramó en la camisa todas las flores de abril. ¿Quién le dijo que yo era? Risa siempre, nunca llanto como si fuera la primavera. No soy tanto y cambio que espiritual que usted me brinda una rosa de su rosa principal. De qué callada manera se me adentra usted sonriendo como si fuera la primavera. Yo muriendo, yo muriendo. De qué callada manera se me adentra usted sonriendo. Como si fuera la primavera, yo muriendo, yo muriendo. Yo muriendo, 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 yo muriendo. Thank you, thank you. We'd like to do an original of Brian's. Okay. This one is as of yet un, not recorded. Well, not on a CD. Not on a CD. Though. It is recorded, but uh, that's a whole other matter. The song is, uh, it was inspired by a movie that Rosie and I watched several years ago that takes place on the Camino de Santiago in Northern Spain. And the song is Buen Camino, Good Path. It says, good path, good detour, Good stumble and good recovery, good and in, good injury, good remedy, good failure and good redemption. The road is your destiny. The road is yours, nothing more nor less. If you see me, greet me in passing and good redemption. Buen camino, buen desvío. Buen tropiezo, buena recuperación, buena herida, buen remedio, buen fracaso y buena redención. Buen conflicto 
conflicto Buena reconciliación Buen descanso Buen trabajo Buena lucha Y buena aceptación Buen camino El camino Buen respiro El camino Buen tropiezo Buena recuperación Buena herida, si me ves, buen remedio, dame, buen fracaso y buena redención. Buen fracaso y buena redención. Muchas gracias. Gracias. This is a classic from Cuba by uh, Osvaldo Farres. It's called Quizás, 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 made famous in this country as Perhaps, Perhaps, Perhaps by Nat King Cole. If you know it, sing along. That goes for the studio audience. That goes for the live audience. That goes for the non-live audience. You know what I'm saying, right? Can't speak English today. <laughs> Little bit. Siempre que te pregunto ah, que cuando, cómo y dónde, tú siempre ah, me respondes, quizás, 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 quizás. Y así pasan los días Y yo desesperando Y tú, tú contestando Quizás, quizás, quizás Estás perdiendo el tiempo Pensando, pensando Por lo que más tú quieras ¿Hasta cuándo? ¿Hasta cuándo? Y así y pasan los días Y yo, y yo, yo desesperando, desesperando Y tú, y tú, tú contestando Quizás, quizás, quizás You won't admit you love me But so, how am I ever to know You only tell me Perhaps, perhaps, perhaps A million times I You, and then I ask you over again You only answer Perhaps, perhaps, perhaps If you can make your mind up We'll never get started And I don't want to wind up Being parted, broken hearted So if you really love me Say yes Say yes, yes and if but if you, you don't, don't, dear, confess, confess and please don't, don't tell me, me, perhaps, perhaps, perhaps. Quizás, quizás, quizás. Tell me, darling, quizás, quizás, quizás. If you can make your mind up, 
from Cuba or Cuban influence, we're going to move to Venezuela. This is a song we've been doing for some time that we fell in love with years ago called Tonada de Luna Llena by Simón Díaz from Venezuela. Simón Díaz was sort of like the Pete Seeger of no, Venezuela. No, no, no. no. Pete, Pete Seeger was is like Simon the Simón Díaz of, of the United States. That's it. Eso mismo. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Simón was a, he, a, a rescuer of folkloric traditions, a, an amazing composer. He had a TV show for many years. And he really was sort of like the, uh, the uncle to everyone in Venezuela, Venezuela at one point. And um, the tonada is a style of music that's sung by the, the cowboys on the plains of Venezuela as they milk their cows. It calms them and apparently they produce more milk that way. So this is a style, it's in that style and it's, it's a little bit um, surreal. It says, I saw a blue heron doing battle with the river. That's how my heart fell in love with yours. Go on home, boy, and fetch me my rifle so I can kill this chicken hawk that's leaving me without any chickens. The, the moon is watching me. I don't know what it sees. My clothes are clean. I washed them yesterday. Full moon, full moon waning. Muchacho a la casa y me traes la carabina Pa' matar este gavilán Que no me deja gallinas La luna me está mirando Yo no sé lo que me ve Yo tengo la ropa limpia Ayer tarde la lavé Yo no sé lo que me ve Yo tengo la ropa limpia Yo tengo la ropa limpia Ayer tarde la lavé Ayer tarde la lavé Luna, luna, luna Luna ya la vengo Luna, luna Luna ya Ah, 
Así es como se enamora tu corazón con el mío. Yo vi de una garza morada dándole combate a un río. Así es como se enamora. Así es como se enamora tu corazón con el mío. Tu corazón con el mío Luna, luna Luna llena menguante Luna, luna, luna llena Gracias. Thank you so much. Tonada de luna llena. Isn't that beautiful? So beautiful. Cool arrangement by Brian, by the way. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's on our second to last CD, which we just happened to have with us in the little tiendita, the little store right behind <laughs> Marcy, <laughs> with other cool things like some of the beautiful bilingual children's audiobooks that we have recorded over the years that we've had the honor and pleasure of recording many of them with music um, compositions and playing mostly guitar and other things by Brian so we would like to do something to honor some of our friends from Puerto Rico who are here and because I'm from Puerto Rico and as you know the donations this evening partial proceeds are going to be going to Puerto Rico, in particular to the town of Morovis in Puerto Rico, where we have a very dear friend who, in fact, is a documentary maker. She's in the, in the biz, uh, and she has um, made it her mission to help the people of Morovis, many of whom are still without electricity and running water. So little by little, the money that we've been sending But they have raising, lots of paper towels. <laughs> There's that. <laughs> but unfortunately, that doesn't turn the lights on. So, um, so thank you for, for donating this evening. And for any of you who are watching, um, we are gladly accepting still donations to send to Morovis. Uh, and the information is right there. Oh, except that tiny is spelled wrong. Tiny is with a Y. <laughs> it's tiny. <laughs> oh, she immediately took it off. <laughs> Got the hook. Tinyurl.com. And whatever the hell, heck it says. Did I say heck? Yeah, yeah I said heck. <laughs> I was checking my language there. Rosie, Ooh, this is network TV. Me Come on. Te pasa? <laughs> <laughs> so we're going to do a beautiful song from Puerto Rico. It's sort of the unofficial national anthem of Puerto Rico. It's called Verde Luz by Antonio Cabanvale. Green light. Very emotional song. Just after the hurricane in, in Boston. Green light of mountains big group and got sea. Together. When I am absent from your, be your beautiful beaches and your whispering palms, I want to return. I want to see your sky free and your star alone. Para Puerto Rico. Verde luz de monte y mar Es la virgen del si me ausento de tus playas primorosas Si me alejo de tus palmas silenciosas Quiero volver, quiero volver A sentir, a sentir la tibia arena A dormir, a dormir en tus riberas Isla, Isla mía, flor cautiva para ti quiero tener Isla tu cielo Sola tu estrella Isla doncella Quiero tener Verde luz De monte y Verde luz de monte y mar. Verde luz de monte y mar. 
Isla Virgen del Coral Coral. Si me ausento de tus playas primorosas Si me alejo de tus palmas silenciosas Quiero volver, quiero volver a sentir, a sentir la tibia arena, a dormir, a dormir en tus riberas, isla mía, flor cautiva, para ti quiero tener libre tu cielo, sola tu estrella, isla doncella quiero tener. Verde luz de monte y mar. Verde luz de monte y mar, isla virgen del coral. Verde luz de monte y mar. Thank you, thank you. Well, now here's something very special for us, always, anytime we do this, and that is we're going to feature our daughter, Alisa Amador who's with us, and I have to tell you a great story about Alisa. She um, came with us the last time we played in Los Angeles with Soli Canto was when we, re- when we released our children's CD. We have a bilingual CD for children, which she and her sibling sang on, harmonies on, when they were seven, and we came, I think when they were eight, uh, we did a sort of extended CD release for a year, and the Getty Museum brought us, and we did two shows there, And so, obviously, she doesn't remember a whole lot from that visit and was very eager to come back to Los Angeles. And we're super happy that she's uh, here. And now she's a singer-songwriter and composing prolifically. And we're really excited to share some of her music with us. And it's kind of turned around. Now we get to harmonize with her. It's so beautiful. (laughs) I also want everybody to know, because I'm very proud of this, I am a proud mommy, yes, that uh, Saturday we did a full-day workshop in Boston with Scott Parkin, who many of you know out there. And um, he was fantastic. He coached us on the real conversational read, and we did a lot of improv. And Alisa was there. And, and she, she rocked it. She did great. <laughs> so a round of applause for Alisa. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. My mother wins A plus for encouragement. <laughs> <laughs> Well, I, I hope you'll, all of you beach goers out there, <laughs> will um, forgive my, my attire. Even though I'm from Boston, I get cold so easily <laughs> that my body's in shock. <laughs> um, so here's a song called Blood Beats. It's a song that I wrote um, in my room in Cambridge, looking out the window and thinking about how the wild weather of Boston can be such a metaphor all the time for what's going on on the inside. And uh, <laughs> Alisa was telling me today, if I lived here, I never would have written this song. I never would have written it. <laughs> it's like, I look out the window, it's sunny. The next day I look out the window, it's sunny. You know, what, what am I going to write about? <laughs> But I'll have, I'll have you know, this song is not just about the weather. So I hope you listen closely and I hope It takes you on a loving journey. Also, do I have something in my teeth? (laughs) (laughs) I feel like there's some. No. Mm. Okay, let's go. (laughs) Well, you let me know. (laughs) Okay. It's funny how windows are mirrors to all that is outside and all that is in And mirrors can become a window when you take a moment to look at your skin Well, outside the snow is a tumbling glow of commotion Behind this wall is a thundering call To embrace all the chaos within Centuries of wisdom 
can make you so blind Your blood beats the rhythm to the answers you'll find All of the years, let them pass on through and all of the fears, let them pass through you. And all of the love left out in the cold, let them go. Let them go. It's funny how thoughts turn to truth. When you give them the time and the space that they need And truths are just products of thoughts Be they good or they bad It's the truth that they feed All of this mess trapped inside of your chest It's emotion Locked in this brain is a quiet refrain To embrace all the chaos within Centuries of wisdom Can make you so blind Your blood beats the rhythm To the answers you'll find All of the years, let them pass on through And all of the fears, let them pass through you And all of the love left out in the cold Let them go All of the years, let them pass on through And all of the fears, let them pass through you And all of the love left out in the cold Rosy, Brian, Amado! <laughs> What an honor. That's a my little girl. Otra. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right. <laughs> so here's a song I wrote in Spanish called Palomita, which um, it means two things, as I was reminded one day when I pop quizzed the audience, what does Palomita mean? And people were like, little pigeon. And then one little girl was like, Popcorn. <laughs> and I was like, "You're right. You're not wrong." Palomitas de maíz are popcorn. Yeah, yeah. So, but this song is not really about popcorn. <laughs> I wish it were about popcorn. But it was about uh, when I when I moved to I lived in Argentina, and when I first started living there, yeah, I did not have friends. I mean, I didn't know anybody. So uh, the only living thing I got to dialogue with, well, it wasn't a dialogue. I guess I talked. To it <laughs> were the pigeons that lived in my window. They nested in my window. And my host mother would come into my room and see the pigeons like, kurru, kurru, like they're in the window. And she'd be like, Nana, you have to hit the window like this so that the birds fly away. And I'd be like, no, 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 that's my friend. <laughs> don't, don't kick him out. <laughs> um, so this song starts um, addressed to the pigeon. Little pigeon, little gray pigeon. You don't explain to me why I'm here. 
and the stars, they don't tell me the stories that they used to of love, war, and peace. These days I get lost in myself, and words are just a false smile. And from this southern continent with winter in its womb and these rains that never stop, I ask you to take away the memories of the mornings and the apples and the light from your window. And I have the tremendous honor of having Rosy y Brian Amador harmonizing with me again. So. Palomita, palomita gris, no me explicas por qué estoy aquí, solo miras y echas a volar. Las estrellas no me cuentan más de sus cuentos de amor, guerra y paz, solo miran desde el más allá. En estos días me pierdo. Las palabras, una falsa sonrisa Y desde el sur del continente Con invierno en el vientre Y las lluvias sin parar Llévate las mañanas Llévate Manzanas, tus ojos, tu pelo, el olor de tu cuello, la luz por tu ventana. No sabía que al caminar a tu lado me iba a enamorar, que una sonrisa te puede marear. Las estrellas nos contaron mal nuestra historia Tenía un final, el silencio te puede matar En estos días me pierdo en mí misma Y las palabras son una falsa sonrisa Y desde el sur del continente con invierno en el vientre y las lluvias y las lluvias sin parar Llévate las mañanas, llévate las manzanas Tus ojos, tu pelo, el olor de tu cuello, la luz Mañanas, llévate las manzanas, tus ojos, tu pelo, el olor de tu cuello, la luz por tu ventana. Thank you. This is so cool. This is my first time playing in Los Angeles. <laughs> Actually, she she played when she was about four, but she doesn't remember it. Yeah, and by play, he means like playing with my brother. No, on the yeah, floor. but you, you were singing on stage with us. You just weren't playing guitar yet. Yeah. Okay, you're right. You're right. No, they, I think there were eight, right? Oh, maybe seven. eight. Yeah, seven, okay, right? Okay, yeah, so. at the Getty. But oh, so I played at the Getty. Yeah, yeah so. <laughs> she's played at the Getty. So you've been, you've been playing in, in L.A. for 14 years already. <laughs> <laughs> this is just your success. This is my return. encore performance. <laughs> 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 oh, so, well, it's such an honor to get to play with these incredible musicians who raised me and taught me how to do this thing. 
And it's also such an honor to perform in front of all of you, people who I didn't know. And now, now I do. And now you do. <laughs> it's so awesome how music can do that. And community. Thank you so much, Dan and George, for putting this together. Yeah. <laughs> This is a happy breakup song called Never Seem to Last. And uh, those are the lyrics that I invite you to sing with me. <laughs> the chorus goes like this. It goes like this. Never, never, never seem to last. Never, never, never seem to last. Never, never, never seem to last. Yes, beautiful Sherman Oaks people. I love your voices. Please celebrate all of the viscerality of youthful breakups or anything that makes you angry. <laughs> there are so many things, I imagine. Through this song, here we go. And it's been a long, long time since I thought of you. It's been a long, long time like a day or two. You're always on my mind, don't know what to do. It's been a long, long time since I thought of you. Oh, I'm always lonely. It's a part of me. I don't need anybody's help with that. You say that you want me. Do anything for me. But that ain't the same as having my back No No, 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 no It's been a long, long time since I've been at home It's been a long, long time all the plans have grown It's been a long, long time that I lived in LA <laughs> It's been a long, long time since I've been at home I'm always lonely, it's a part of me I don't need anybody's help with that You say that you want me, do anything for me But that ain't the same as having my back You seem like a good one turns to past I'm tired of the loves that never, 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 never seem to last They never, never, never seem to last They never, never, never seem to last Keep it going! Never, now never, I find myself never a different to tune never, My friends, never, they think I'm sad that ain't last. true never, I cried never, a single tear never, And never, now I'm through never, Now never, I find myself playing A different last. tune I'm always lonely It's a part of me And I don't need anybody's help with that You say that you want me Do anything for me but that ain't the same as heaven, heaven my back You will seem like a good one How could I forget that every present turns to past I'm tired of the loves that never, 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 never seem to last oh, oh, oh. won't be home I'm always alone ha. but I'm never home because they never never never, never seem to last they never 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 seem to last they never 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 never, never, never seem to Never, 
a single tear, a single tear, a single tear for you, baby. I got a single tear, I'm got a single tear, I'm got a single tear, a single tear, I got a single tear, I cried a single tear, I cried a single tear, and now I'm through. Bravo! Bravo! Thank you! Incredible audience. Yeah. Yeah, I didn't quite make it. Okay, there you go. Yeah, but I, I I can't see anybody when those. Can you just can you read them off the table maybe? Okay. So anyway, we're gonna make a little bit of a change of pace here. Something you probably weren't expecting. A country song. <laughs> I grew up in a very interesting and bizarre place called Albuquerque, New Mexico. <laughs> and uh, one thing about New Mexico is, you know, there's this blend of cultures there. It's, it's kind of Hispanic, it's kind of Anglo, and it's a little bit country. So one day I was sitting around and I looked in this dark, dusty corner of my mind and I saw a country singer there. And he gave me this song. It's called carve my initials in the tree of life. I would like to dedicate this song to the closest thing I have to a sister, who is Penny Griego, right over here. Oh, I've known her since we were both little youngins. <laughs> and uh, so this is for you, Pen. Yeah. I'm not gonna live forever. That is one thing that I know Someday I'll be fertilizer Hope to make some green things grow I'm not gonna live forever But there's one thing I can see I am gonna do some living Long before they bury me I'm gonna carve my initials in the tree of life Leave on you know, give them the dark When you fall, gonna get back up Keep on drinking from the loving cup Carve our initials in the cosmic tree Leave a heart that says you plus me Won't give up without a fuss Make damn sure they will remember us gonna live forever that is one thing that's for sure because we're here but for a moment and for death there ain't no cure you're not gonna live forever so there's one thing you must do just be sure to do some living Long before they bury you, you've got to carve your initials in the tree of life. Keep on living till the day you die. When you fall, you gotta get back up. Keep on drinking from the loving cup. Carve your initials in the cosmic tree. Leave a heart that says you plus me. Won't give up without a fuss. Make them sure they will remember us. Whoa. in the tree of life keep on living till the day we die when we fall we're gonna get back up keep on drinking from the loving cup carve our initials in the cosmic tree leave a heart that says you bless me won't give up without a fuss make damn sure they will remember us Initials. <laughs> uh.
<clears throat> so anyway. Oh, okay. And now for a total change of pace. Another song that uh, actually very reminiscent of New Mexico. Some years ago, I wrote a suite for our full sextet plus a string quart quartet. And it's all about food. It's called Sabor y Memoria, a musical feast in seven courses. And uh, this is one of the movements, sans string quartet, of course. That's right. And I just want to mention that we are very grateful to say that we had a crowdfunding campaign. And I would say about 80% of it was funded by all of our voiceover friends and colleagues. Some of you are right here who helped us fund Sabori Memoria. So thank you. And thank you to those who are out there who helped fund it, along with our family. <laughs> because it wouldn't, it wouldn't exist without actually, that. Um, mm -hmm. Yes, and we actually have, happen to have a recording of it here, if you're interested. It has, um, we can, it has either a CD or a DVD. The DVD has wonderful uh, photo montages that accompany all the music. So I highly recommend it. And I also would, would like to dedicate this song to the very first, when, uh, when we launched the fundraising campaign, the very first person to give us a donation was Mr. Dan Leonard. Yay! That's right. Did and you know that's that? the Did kind you know that? of guy Dan is because exactly. he's always supporting other people and helping other people. And so this song is for you, Dan. Yeah. yeah. It says, I was far from home in a strange land when the smell of chilies took me back to my ranch. The years rolled backwards, the miles, disap the miles rolled backwards, the years disappeared. Again, I saw my grandmother shaping tortillas. Smell of chilies, smell of childhood, so many years erased by nothing more than a fragrance. Smell of chiles, smell of home, made me forget how life passes by. Estaba muy lejos de casa, en un lugar ajeno, cuando un olor a chile. Me llevo a mi terreno Se desvanecieron los años Retrocedieron las millas Otra vez ya mi abuela Amasando tortillas Olor a chile Tantos años borrados por nada más que una fragancia Olor a chiles, olor a casa Me ha hecho olvidar de cómo la vida pasa Hay bocas que hablan de mí Con odio y con desprecio Mientras se comen los frutos Que yo les cosecho Me vine a apuros para el norte Y cuando siento ese aroma Me devuelve a mi rancho Olor a chiles, olor a infancia Tantos años borrados por nada más que una fragancia Olor a chiles, olor a casa Me ha hecho olvidar de cómo la vida pasa
retroactively also dedicated to Penny because it brought New Mexico home for her and made her cry. I know. <laughs> she was smelling those chiles. Yeah, oh, right. my God. Yeah. <laughs> Time to go home for a visit, right, yeah. Pen? <laughs> I think so. <laughs> we'll help you pack your bags. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Okay. Brian's going to do a very new song that, uh, well, I'll let him explain. Yeah, um, recently a friend of mine suggested to me that I write a song for, a, a lullaby for the children who've been separated from their families at the border. And I, I thought it was a great idea, but when I started to do it, it just, I mean, all I felt was rage, so it was very hard to channel that into a lullaby, but I figured out how to do it by using the rage. So um, this is called... Nana Rabiosa, Raging Lullaby. The, part, the lullaby part is in Spanish. I'll translate it for you. The, the, uh, and then there's a rap in English to the people that put them there. There's also a refrain that keeps repeating in the English part that is, Son niños carajo, they're children, damn it. The, uh, the lullaby says, Sleep, little girl, sleep. Sleep if you can. Far from your papi in your gray cell. Sleep, little boy, sleep. Know that your mommy thinks of nothing but you. Longs for no one but you and is in search of you. Um, sleep, little girl, sleep. And if they mistreat you, it's nothing personal. It's just that those people can't, are not capable of seeing you as a human being. You're nothing but collateral damage. Um, sleep, little girl, sleep. Know that this long night will come to an end. We won't forget you. We won't give up until you wake up in freedom. Duerme niña, duerme Duerme si puedes Lejos de tu papi En tu celda gris Duerme niño, duerme Sepas que tu mami no piensa más que en ti, no añora más que a ti y en busca va de ti. Duerme niña, duerme. Duerme si puedes Y si te maltratan No es nada personal Es que esa gente No es capaz de verte como un ser humano No eres más que daño Colateral That was a lullaby I needed to write the children sleeping in cages tonight Far from their homes, their friends and their mommies Their cousins and their tias and their siblings and papis And now a little verse for those who put them there How dare you, have you no shame? Are you so blinded by hate that you can't wait to cause another person pain? Can you accept the things they're doing in your name? Is it right to rip a mother from her child for the crime of asking for asylum? A little shelter from the storm? A chance to see her kids grow up? Having come so far just to end up in a cage, it puts me in a rage. Son niños carajo. All your excuses, your blame and your justification, all the bile, denial and obfuscation can convince the sentient your intentions are good any more than Judas could. You betray your humanity, display your insanity, tear apart families for the sake of your vanity. A wall, you say, build a wall. How about you build yourself a conscience? 
How about we build ourselves a country with a heart, a connection to the world, an unbreakable democracy instead of a pathetic misanthropic plutocracy? How about we treat every child like our own, treat the earth like our home, learn to live together so we don't die alone? Remember, every child is a child is a child. Son niños carajo, son niños carajo, son niños carajo, son niños carajo. Duerme niña, duerme, duerme si puedes, que esta noche larga tendrá su final. No te olvidaremos, no descansaré. Hasta que amanezcas, hasta que amanezcas en libertad. Thank you. We're gonna take a break, you guys. Huh? Okay. Well, we're going to take a little break here now. Vote. Yeah, vote. <laughs> yeah, vote. Well, hello there. I bet you weren't expecting to hear some big-voiced announcer guy on your new orientation training for Snapchat, were you? This is Virgin Radio. Well, okay, we're not that innocent. There's jeans for wearing and there's jeans for working. Dickies, cause I ain't here to look pretty. She's a champion of progressive values, a leader for California, and a voice for America. It's smart. It's a phone. It's a smartphone. But it's so much more. It's a, the files are ready. Don't forget to pick up the eggs. What time is hockey practice? Check out this song. It's the end of the road for Rick. It's just you and me, Rick. When hope is lost. The I-8 from BMW. Who said saving the planet couldn't be stylish? Hey, it's J. Michael Collins. Bet you think I'm going to try and sell you a demo now, huh? I think they speak for themselves. But I will give you my email. It's jmichael at jmcvoiceover.com. Now, if Dan will stop waxing his mustache for a minute, we'll get back to the show. Hey, everybody. This is George Whittem, and I want to tell you about one of our wonderful sponsors, and that is Source Elements. They're the creators of Source Connect. So if you need to connect your voiceover studio with other studios around the world, this is the tool for you. This is the one you want to have available to you in your studio. It is absolutely the industry standard now. It's taken over. It's taken over momentum from ISDN as ISDN has become so expensive to purchase and basically unavailable. And now you can stream real time and very high quality to studios anywhere. It's the one you want to have if you're playing a bigger game, competing at a higher level. And a lot of agents these days demand it that you have to have it. So you can get a 15 day free trial of Source Connect Standard over at source-elements.com. Go ahead and grab it, get it up and running. You don't even have to have an iLock key to use it. Okay, we'll be right back here in just a few minutes with more entertainment right here at VOBS. Thanks for watching. Are you confused about how to set up and maintain a professional quality voiceover studio? No wonder. The information out there is mostly mythology. This is the best microphone to use. You have to have a preamp. You need a soundproof booth. This software is the best. Your audio must be broadcast quality. Consult with someone who knows the truth. Someone who's been there, in the trenches, doing voiceover for over 30 years. Someone with unparalleled experience with voiceover studios, who's worked with hundreds of voice actors and designed hundreds of personal studios. He knows how to teach and cares about your success in one of the harshest environments known to voiceover, your home. Dan Leonard, the home studio master. Separate myth from fact and get a handle on your personal voiceover studio. Contact the home studio master at homevoiceoverstudio.com. 
Your dynamic voiceover career requires extra resources to keep moving ahead. Now there's one place where you can explore everything the voiceover industry has to offer. That place is voiceoverextra.com. Whether you're just exploring a voiceover career or a seasoned veteran ready to reach that next professional level, stay in touch with market trends, coaching, products and services while avoiding scams and other pitfalls. Voiceover Extra has hundreds of articles, free resources and training that will save you time and help you succeed. Learn from the most respected talents, coaches and industry insiders when you join the online sessions bringing you the most current information on topics like audiobooks, auditioning, casting, home studio setup and equipment, marketing, performance techniques and much more. It's time to hit your one-stop daily resource for voiceover success. Sign up for a free subscription to newsletters and reports and get 14 bonus reports on how to ace the voiceover audition. It's all here at voiceoverextra.com. That's voiceoverxtra.com. Hey, everybody. Where's everybody going? We still got more to play here. For those of you wondering, uh, Marcy and I like to come across as the Yucca Leonards. <laughs> Soli Kanto will be back out in just a couple of minutes, but... Uh, We've been rehearsing this all week, so you might as well sit down and listen in here for a second. I feel so bad, I got a worried mind. I'm so lonesome all of the time. Since I left my baby behind on Blue Bayou. Saving nickels, saving dimes Playing till the sun don't shine Looking forward to happier times On Blue Bayou I'm going back someday Come what may to Blue Bayou Where the folks are fine And the world is mine On Blue Bayou where the catfish play, play all day If I could only see, see That familiar sunrise with sleepy eyes How happy I'd be Gonna see my baby again Gonna be with all of my friends Maybe I'll be happy then on Blue Bayou I'm going back someday, come what may, to Blue Bayou Where you sleep all day and the catfish play on Blue Bayou With that girl of mine by my side the silver moon and the evening time Ah, oh, some sweet day gonna take away this hurting inside Well, I'll never be blue, my dreams come true On blue by you And now my wife, Marcy, will play on her ukulele. So I'm the other half of the ukuleners, and, um, and I'm using this opportunity for some shameless self-promotion. Yeah. <laughs> which, which is the point of our show, by the way. Yes, so, so you know of my house for the studio, and you know now for the outdoor arena, but, but you don't know about the sweatshop. And um, this past weekend, this was the sweatshop. Actually, Denny was here for the sweatshop. And I have started creating this little product. It's called Natural Nonsense Number 420. We did our production run this week. And you spray it on your hair and your clothes, and you don't reek like pot anymore. So natural nonsense. <laughs> and N-O-N-S-C-E-N-T-S www.naturalnonsense.com. Hopefully you will be seeing it everywhere. 
so um, this is a new venture for me. Uh, I have done lots of things that people expected me to do my whole life, and um, now I'm doing something that is totally unexpected and selling uh, in the cannabis industry. And uh, much more fun. yeah, much more fun, and uh, and it's making California ever so much better for me because um, it's making California great again. Yes, yeah, making California. Well, I I've, I've only been here for three years, so for me, it's making it great. So this is kind of like my my new little personal anthem. Ooh, it sounds like I'm out of tune. Oh well. <laughs> I can see clearly now the rain is gone I can see all obstacles in my way Gone are the dark clouds that had me blind It's gonna be a <laughs> Sunshiny day. I think I can make it now. The pain is gone. All of my bad feelings have disappeared. Here is the rainbow I've been praying for. It's gonna be a bright, bright, sunshiny day. <laughs> Look all around, nothing but blue skies. Look straight ahead, nothing but blue skies. I can see clearly now the rain is gone. I can see all obstacles in my way. Gone are the dark clouds that had me blind. It's gonna be a bright, bright, sunshiny day. It's gonna be a bright, bright, sunshiny day. Gonna be a bright, bright, sunshiny day. Thank yeah. you. I will admit that I actually had to watch some YouTube videos this week on playing the ukulele. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Uh, how many of you saw Mighty Wind? Remember that movie? Great movie. There, yeah, they're, well, now you're going to really want to see it. First, first off, Scott Parkin, if you're watching, uh, thank you. The important thing was to note that he said, never play with somebody who's better than you before you. Uh, so. well, you, you know how, like, on American Idol, they would send those people out? And <laughs> We can't do it once it's our house. Yeah. That's, that's, that's right. us. That's us, the ones that are there for the uh, right. comic relief. Right. So. This is a song by Michael McCain and Eugene <laughs> Levy that we love to sing together. Oh, when, when the veil, veil of dreams, dreams has lifted, lifted and the fairy tales have all been told there's a kiss at the end of the rainbow more precious than a pot of gold in days of ancient glory every knight and maiden fair shall be joined when the quest is over and the kiss is the oath that they share and when the veil of dreams has lifted and the fairy tales have all been told there's a kiss at the end of the rainbow more precious than a pot of gold my sweet my dear my darling your 
so far away from me. <laughs> though an ocean, though an ocean of tears divides us. I don't know, I'm on the wrong part. <laughs> but the bridge of our love span the seas. And when the veil of dreams has lifted, and the fairy tales have all been told. There's a kiss at the end of the rainbow, more precious than a pot of gold. Your kiss, there's a kiss at the end of the rainbow. More precious than a pot of gold. <laughs> All right, we'll be right back. Soli Canto with their next set. Stay tuned. Number 420. <laughs> oh. Oh. Ladies and gentlemen, once again, Soli Canto. <laughs> Woo! Marcy, another round of applause. <laughs> applause, applause. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. So Penny said we need to play things upbeat to because yeah, she was so crying she for the last crying. two songs. So uh, <laughs> this is just the thing. This is a cumbia. It's a rhythm from from Colombia, but it's popular all over Latin America. And this one is uh, it's one I wrote recently. It's called Epidemia de Soledad, which means epidemic of loneliness. Yes, it's a cheery little ditty. <laughs> they say there's an epidemic, a real plague, that people are dying of loneliness, more damaging than tobacco, more damaging than alcohol. It's like a thorn in the heart. Oh, doctor, what can you give me to take away this pain? Oh, pain, what can, what can I take to feel better? And then uh, Dr. Rosie says, you know, know that you're not alone in your loneliness. Your problem is more common every day. I see it all the time. Um, there are many remedies you can try. None of them are perfect, but they might help. A little, um, a good meal, a dose of laughter, calling up a friend and going out for a walk, a Zumba class, doing yoga or meditating, or grabbing your partner and dancing a cumbia. So, That's it. we have the solution. We have the, uh, the remedy. Y dice... Dicen que hay una epidemia, una plaga de verdad, que la gente está muriendo de soledad. Más dañino que el tabaco, más dañino que el alcohol, es como una espina en el corazón. Ay, doctor, ¿qué me puede dar para quitarme este dolor? Ay, dolor, ¿qué puedo yo tomar? sentirme mejor hoy hoy no es único su caso cada vez lo veo más sepa que no está sola en su soledad no importa su tribu Religión a creencia, hay tantas personas con la misma dolencia. Ay, doctor, ¿qué me puede dar? ¿Qué me puede dar? Pa' quitarme este dolor. Ay, dolor, ¿qué puedo yo tomar? Para sentirme mejor. Hay muchos remedios que usted puede tomar Ninguno es perfecto, pero le pueden ayudar Menos redes sociales, más contactos reales Menos amargura y más gratitud una buena comida, una dosis de risa, llamar a una amiga y salir a caminar. Meditar, hacer yoga, una clase de zumba, 
o agarrar su pareja y bailar una cumbia. Ay, doctor, ¿qué me puede dar? Pa' quitarme este dolor. Ay, dolor, ¿qué puedo yo tomar? Para sentirme mejor. Ay, doctor, ¿qué me puede dar? Este dolor, quitarme este dolor. Hay dolor que puedo yo tomar para sentirme mejor. We're going to do something that actually comes from a composer from the Dominican Republic, very famous for his more danceable rhythms, Juan Luis Guerra. <laughs> This song is actually a gorgeous love song. It's called Amapola. Do you know it? I bet you might know it. Well, you might recognize it. It's really beautiful. <laughs> you do, Dan? Oh. From your radio days? Nice. Oh, wow. Wow. Cool. cool. <laughs> That's amazing. Lisa, you want to give a little translation? Sure. It's a very beautiful love song that uses all the metaphors of the natural world for the love that they should have for this person. So it says, part the leaves of the wind, my love, put a saddle on, on the river. And as you ride, if you get cold, warm, uh, cover yourself in the fur of the stars for a pillow, the full moon, my love, and... For a dream, the love I have for you. A poppy told me yesterday, Amapola, that I'm going to see you. And a rainbow painted my skin so that I would wake up beside you. Abre las hojas del viento, mi vida. Ponle una montura al río. Cabalga y si te da frío te arropas con la piel de las estrellas De almohada la luna llena mi vida y de sueño el amor mío Y una amapola me lo dijo ayer que te voy a ver, que te voy a ver y un arco iris me pintó la piel para amanecer contigo. Y una amapola me lo dijo ayer, que te voy a ver, que te voy a ver. Y un arco iris me pintó la piel para amanecer. Contigo Cierra la noche y el día mi vida Para que todo sea nuestro Y una gran fuga de besos Se pose sobre tu boca el tirinar de las rosas mi vida te diga cuánto te quiero y una amapola me lo dijo ayer que te voy a ver que te voy a ver y un arco iris me pintó la piel para amanecer contigo y una amapola me lo dijo ayer Que te voy a ver, que te voy a ver Y un arco iris me pintó la piel Para amanecer contigo Y un arco iris me pintó la piel Para amanecer Contigo. Thank you so much. 
Thank you, Dan. Thank you, George. Thank you, everybody. Thank you, everybody who heard us through VOBS, the live broadcast. And especially thanks to those of you who remained later on a Monday night, now having to deal with traffic on the way home. We really appreciate it. There's no traffic now. Oh, we heard there's traffic all the time. So <laughs> that's how it was. LA was sold to us. <laughs> anyway, we're really happy we came and we are honored and thrilled to have been here this evening. And um, should we end with with our with with this song? Uh, with the medley of our greatest hit. The yeah. medley of our greatest hit. Yeah, sure. <laughs> <laughs> I think so. <laughs> I think we should do that. Okay. Um, one more time, thanks to everybody. Yes. And again, this is Alisa Amador, <laughs> and our daughter, born in Boston, Massachusetts. <laughs> this is my husband Brian Amador from Albuquerque, New Mexico, on guitar and compositions. And from Santurce, Puerto Rico, her family from Puerto Rico and Argentina, Rosy Amador. <laughs> Cangrejera. <laughs> and thank you to Dan, George, and Sue for yeah. running this awesome thing yeah. every Monday. And thank you to Marcy also for hosting. And yes, and yeah. the beautiful music. We have CDs for sale for all of you who are here and for all of you watching us from Spain. <laughs> yeah, <that's right. laughs> um, we also have there is uh, an online social store, media. Spotify, yeah, YouTube. Da, 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 da. That's right. Yeah, follow Alisa us Amador on Facebook, Instagram. We all go by the name of our project, so it's not complicated. Um, <laughs> so we hope you'll follow us with your hearts and with your ears in the days to come. Thank yes, you. We do have a show actually next Monday night in Encino. So if anybody's interested and you want to let your friends know, we can give you some information about that. We have it here. Or if yeah. you have any friends in the Santa Cruz area, we will be playing yes. there a week from Friday. On November so. 16th, we'll be in Santa Cruz as well. Yeah. So. And if you yeah. want to have us over at your house for music, yeah. we're available. We're here for two weeks. Yeah. <laughs> so. <laughs> we're here all week. Exactly. Okay. 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 So. All the nations like banana. <laughs> All the races like banana. All the nations like banana. From the east coast of Nicaragua via Jamaica. All Galizo. the races like banana. Whoa, Mexico like it. banana. New Mexico like it. banana. Puerto Rico like it. banana. Jamaica like it. banana. Australia like it. banana. New Zealand like it. banana. Canada like it. banana. USA like it. banana. Banana, banana, banana. All the nations like banana. We need some dancers who can be in our in our in our spot All here and dance the with us. Like banana. Come, come to Spain, banana, come and dance banana. with us. The dance floor the nations are... like banana. Everybody's dancing, oh yeah. All the races like banana. See ya, Rosa. Oh yes, New York like it. Banana. Chicago like it. Banana. Albuquerque like it. Banana. Like it, banana. Los Angeles like it, banana. Sherman Oaks love it, banana. Banana, banana, banana. All the nations like banana. Sing it with us if you like the banana. You speak English, yes? All the races like banana, banana, banana. All the nations like banana. Sabrosa banana. All the nations like banana. Mama like it. banana, Rosie like it. banana, Alisa like it. banana, and I do too. Banana, how about you? Banana, I bet you do. Banana, you love the banana. Banana, I can see it in your face. Banana, it says banana. Banana, all over the place. Banana, tastes so good. Banana, I'm gonna eat me some. Banana, and it's full of good stuff. Banana, like potassium. Banana, that's why everybody like it. Everybody like it. Banana, 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 banana. Get funky. Time to get, get funky, funky, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. Hey, dice. Hey, hey. Llega el momento de hablarles una cosa. Es una fruta amarilla deliciosa con una carne suavecita y pulposa y minerales que la hacen nutriciosa. Banana por acá, banana por allá. Banana es una fruta que me gusta saborear. Banana por acá, banana por allá. 
Banana es una fruta que se pela para gozar. Es una fruta de familia distinguida, de muchos más, muchos tipos de comida. Plátanos para acompañar cansada bocita, dulces manzanos de casca rosadita. Banana por acá, banana por allá. Banana es una fruta que me gusta saborear. Banana por acá, banana por allá. Banana es una fruta que se pela para gozar. The fruit and bread, but you know it's not a cherry. Not a papaya, pomegranate, or strawberry. No way. It's not a kiwi or a lime or blueberry. It's a banana. Then an answer to your query. Banana por acá, banana por allá. Banana es una fruta que me gusta saborear. Banana por acá, banana por allá. Banana es una fruta que se pela para gozar. It may seem silly that we sing this composition. Oh yes. Please don't believe that we're lacking erudition. No way. Sometimes you can't explain the source of a tradition. But this one has appeal and so it reaches fruition. Banana por acá, banana por allá. Banana es una fruta que me gusta saborear. Banana por acá. Banana por allá, banana es una fruta que se pela para gozar. Banana, banana, all the nations like banana. All the races like banana, banana. All the nations like banana. Delicious, sabrosa banana. All the races like banana. Put your hands. Like banana. More cowbell, yeah? Here we go. Yeah. All the races like banana. All the nations like banana. Thank you, VOBS. Thank you, Sherman Oaks, Los Angeles. All the races like, like banana. banana. <laughs> y buenas noches. Sally Canto. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, well, that was something you weren't expecting on a Monday night, was it? <laughs> right? <laughs> All righty. Well, thanks for being with us tonight. We have to, of course, thank our sponsors, like Harlan Hogan's uh, thank you, Harlan Hogan. vo voiceover essentials. Voice actor websites, J. Michael Collins demos. Who else are we forgetting in there? Uh, Source Elements, VO2GoGo.com right. forward slash. And, uh, <laughs> and of course, the Dan and Marcy Leonard Foundation for Better Webcasting. <laughs> <laughs> thanks for coming tonight. I know we're a little later than we usually are, but uh, thanks Sorry. for coming. We'll be back next week with Joe Davis. So have yourselves right. a great night, everybody. We'll see you right. next thanks, everybody. Monday night. And you are. Thank I'm Dan Leonard. And I'm George, George Whittem. And this is VOBS. Good night.